Uh, hello everyone, I've got seven homes from the Century 21 Millennium tour of new listings on the MLS this week. I'm going to fly through these so as not to bore you too silly. Uh, 6 Pacific Avenue at 129,900. Um, land lease is the important thing, and it will go up to 351, which isn't bad at all. 1,000 square feet, it's on one of the older, more established uh, park place places. So, um, park place places is not a good way to say it, is it? But I'll let you look, you can see, well maintained, more mature lots. A quick look through the photos. Brand new laminate inside, decent sized rooms. And a nice mature plot. You can see. 36 Wasaga Woods Close, 184,900, there's the MLS, uh, nearly 1,300 square feet, condo fees are 217 a month, but as you can see you're getting a lot for your money there. Not, it's only 8 years old, 2002, 3 bedrooms, and um, it's 2 storey, so the big thing with Wasaga Wood, Wasaga Woods Close it's only five minutes walk to Allenwood Beach. You can see a very nice sandy beach. But there we have the huge living area. And I'm flying through these because I don't want it to be a boring video. A proper cottage, 45 69th Street North, 400 steps, a minute, minute and a half to Beach 6. 700 square feet, under 200,000 to be near to that beach, and it is winterized, so it's a four season cottage. Nice and clean inside, 100 foot lot as you can see. A quick look through the photos for you, nice and bright. Nice and little deck out the back, and two decent sized bedrooms. Family homes. Average house price in Wasaga Beach is over 250000 This is a two bedroom family home with three bathrooms for under 250 14 Silver Birch Avenue, 244900, 20104488 is the MLS number. Attractive house, typical uh, Wasaga Beach design. The, the um, basement could do with some extra finishing. But at least there's a rec room down there. Not sure. These are the owners. You shouldn't be in the photos. So okay, that would move. 55 Island View Crescent, again under 250,000, nearly 1,900 square feet over two floors. It has only got a crawl space. This sold for about 50, 10 to 15,000 less two years ago. The owner's a carpenter and he's done a lot of work and upgrades inside, as you can see from the photos. A very pretty, cute, attractive house. Nice hardwood floors, nice fireplace. And cosy as they say, bedrooms upstairs. Right, now we're going around to 39 Cherry Sands Crescent, 309,900. Part two finished bedrooms in the basement, but there's a lot more to be finished. So you've got 1,700 square feet plus that in the basement. Beautiful hardwood floors, really outstanding when you go in. And huge open plan design. You big foyer. And all this is open plan. That looks out onto the living area. Nice garden. Well worth a visit, that one. And finally, 30 Foxwood Crescent. Backs onto Ministry Land, it's stunning. 387,900, 1,700 square feet with a finished basement. Three bedrooms on the main floor, one on the um, in the basement, two bathrooms and one downstairs. It's the, uh, that's the back, you know, it's stunning. Nice and bright, nice inside. Could do with a bit of updating in mind.